Chronic pain, the inner demon, back with another one. No, folks, Zion Williams contemplating suicide. The NBA, the Pelicans player, Zion Williams contemplating suicide, putting verses of a song from the B.I.G., Biggie Smalls, on his Instagram. Let's take a listen about his baby mom for a second, folks. Then there's the whole Zion, Williamson, Mariah Mill situation. <laughs> so Zion goes and does a, uh, a photo shoot with his uh, soon-to-be baby mother. Which I guess ruffled some feathers with some of the other girls that he was dealing with. One of which was uh, a former adult film star, Mariah Mills. Yeah. What's actually interesting, someone actually pointed this out on Twitter, was that um, Mariah, in all of her uh, porn scenes, has never done a scene with a black man. All wow. Mariah, I've never done a scene with a black guy from what they're saying on her porn, in her porn videos. But yes, folks, Zion Williams posts on his Instagram, which sparked concern, you know, and um, caused drama in the, off in the off season on social media, where fans were concerned with his activities on Thursday. You see what I'm saying? This man is only 23 years old. He's a Pelican star. So why did Zion Williams post snippets from the B.I.G. song Suicidal Thoughts appear while Suicidal Thoughts appear while Williams was on Instagram? They said the post feature a transcript of lyrics, I can't believe suicide is on my mind. I want to leave. Wow. Folks, before I go any further, mental health is a hell of a thing. And maybe, just maybe, this young man is crying out for help. And I hope the NBA reacts swiftly and find this young man the right counseling that he needs. He's young, he's 23 years old, he's filthy rich, and he found himself in a quagmire where he impregnated a porn star. But folks, Zion Williams is not the first NBA star was fascinated or infatuated with a porn star. Let me just take you back late 80s, early 90s. There was a porn star, her name, she's still around, not doing porn, but she's still in Hollywood. Her name, Heather Hunter. Now, Heather Hunter was a big star in the late 80s, early 90s. And one folk, one guy from the Los Angeles Lakers was a big fan of Ever Hunter. I am talking about <laughs> no other than the Magic Johnson. Magic Johnson was a big fan of Ever Hunter. 
And at one point, people were even blaming Ever Hunter for Magic Johnson's sickness. I don't know what happened to that. But at one point, they were blaming Ever Hunter. But as time goes by, you'll see Ever Hunter haven't reported in any way, in any database, that she's carrying that special thing. You know that thing that came out in the 80s? Yeah. So yes, folks. That's what I'm saying. Zion Williams is not the first NBA or the second NBA or the third NBA player that got caught up with porn stars. He was just exposed in a time like this because we have social media at our fingertips. And I wish that young man well. You know, he signed a lucrative contract at one point, damn, he was paying over a hundred racks. He was giving this chick over a hundred racks a month allowance to live. Zion, big pimpin' at 23. Woo! Man, I got to turn my game up. I just ain't got Zion money. <laughs> I just don't have Zion money. Maybe I could afford three dollars. <laughs> Zion, man, for real. Get you some help, man. You know, um, there's hotlines out there. I mean, if you're considering what you're considering, the S word, which is suicide, which I don't like that. I don't like those type of posts. I don't like those type of mind frame because I've been there before and I work myself back to where I am today. And I am very happy I didn't do that stupid shit because I was going through a lot of things. Because folks, I live with a rebuilt spine. I have quite a few surgeries on me, spinal fusions and everything. That's why I named my channel Chronic Pain they ain't a demon because I live with pain every day. That doesn't mean I'm a demon. No. The pain is the demon. Because the pain is unseen. You can't, you can't see pain. And that's why I named my channel Chronic Pain The Inner Demon. Because the pain is the inner demon. You see what I'm saying? So, um, Zion Williams, I wish you well, man. Stay focused. And let's see what happens next season with you and the Pelicans down the line, pushing forward towards a championship. My heart goes out to you. Get the help you need. Chronic pain, the inner demon. Like, share, subscribe to the machine. One love, folks. Peace, everybody.